it, Tom. I know you're very, very confident. Obviously, we've seen the build-up. We've seen the social media. It's a fight that you can't see anything but a Tom Stalker victory on Saturday night. Bounce back and forth on, on the Twitter and social media, but it's all done now. I'm ready to win impressively on Saturday night. And if you want to stand and fight, I fucking I think I'm a better better fighter than that. I've, I've watched them that much, right? Recently, I just think I got, it doesn't bring nothing to the table for me. But I haven't disrespect. I've seen that after the fight, and I'm just very confident that I'm going to win easy. The general consensus from the fans in this fight is that if you, you could have potentially outbox Masha, but if it comes down to a fight, Masha wins. You, you don't feel that way. If I, even if I stood in and put him forward with him, I'd outfight him. You know what I mean? Like, I swear, I, he, he's, a, he means like he's a big fitness freak. He's very, very lazy. He, he, he makes lines and that. He, I swear, you see Saturday night, what's going to happen? The bookies have got me at 11 to 8. Please put your money on me, but you're, you're, you're going to win some money Saturday night. Simple as that. It's your first major title. Is it a must win for Tom Stalker or that? Every fight's a must win, but for me, yeah, it is a must win. I'm saying that it's, it's a must win. I'm very, very, very confident. That's that, that is. Masha, Bo Selector. Ed. Um, Meg David. <laughs> <laughs> we, we've got, have you, is that on Anthony? Right, we're going to use this mic instead. Which? It's a bit uh, crackly. We need to make sure. Can any dent? We need to make sure. You, we need to make sure you get your your lyrics. Is it? It's not on. It's not on. Check check. Craig David. Yes, right. we're on. Okay. We know you. We know you laugh and joke, but I have the feeling this young man has got into your skin, and you've got the bit between your teeth going into Saturday night. This is a must-win fight for Masha Dodd. Yeah, um, I've definitely got the bit between my teeth. Um, but my skin's thick, mate, believe me. He ain't, he ain't under my skin. It's just the fact that, he, he, you know, he, he's, a, he's a good kid. It's a good step up. Um, I was a step down at the first press conference. So you were speaking, and now I'm well, you're, you're well, a Well, you know, you're a GB boxer, you're a, you know, so we can't take the facts away, you know what I mean? But that's if I let you box. So it's gonna, it's it's not a boxing match, you know, it's, it's a fight. That's why it's called live fight night, so. Um, you know, I, I've trained hard, I have, and for the, I think with the things he said, it's made, it's made it even more, more spicy for me in training. I've, you know, the, the sacrifices have gone even greater, um, which, you know, he said in one of his interviews, he doesn't need boxing, boxing's only a small part of his life. Well, me missus come back me up on this, boxing is my life, my whole life. I live for it, I, I, I breathe for it, that's all I've got. Without boxing, this is what made me who the person I am today. So without boxing, I've got no way to go. So I've put everything, I've put everything on this. Or, or, you know, I've given everything to, to to beat him. However, I beat him, I will beat him. Is that desire and attitude when it when it gets tough in the fight and it goes into the trenches? Is that what you think is going to pull you through on Saturday night? Do you rely on your ability to fight? I rely on on many things. You know, dedication. Um, sacrifice, you know, attitude, um, you know, confidence, you know, everything. I've got a great team around me, you know, great family, friends. It's all, it's, it's, it's all, it's all fall, falls into place now. So I'm confident that I know he's a great boxer and he, he thinks that I can't box, but he'll get a shot that I can box as well. So. Do you it, have to turn it Saturday night? Probably more or less, yeah. You can't because, fight yeah. this. You can't fight. <laughs> what is it with that side of the table? <laughs> What's in the water? Um, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, we all try and box because when you box, the fight's easy. But sometimes you can't box, sometimes you've got to fight. So I'll try and box. And if come I can't at me box, then, I'll come, at, him, come I mean? at me so then, so the way you think you're gonna come at me and, I, and I'll stop you. That's what will happen. You can't fight your way out of a wet paper bag, let's be honest, Tom. You punch like a girl. You know, you know what I mean? You're a flimsy piece of kit. You're like, you're like one of them um, Argos uh, wardrobes that you buy and put up yourself and then when you walk past it, it nearly falls over. You see, sir, I've got one at home and I've named it Tom. <laughs> Believe me. You're, you know, you're a crying little whinger, mate. You are. You, you, you've got the fight through whinging. You haven't got it through hard work how I got here. I've got it through hard work beating lads who are good kids. 
Hang on a minute, all right, all right. I've been beat twice by Jack Cattle and Craig, Be Craig Evans, right? Go kids. So, would you be, would you be Jack Cattle? Would you be Jack Cattle? I'd say I would be Evans? Jack Cattle now. Who have you boxed? Who have you boxed? You, you don't know until you fight them. But boxed? at the end of the day, I've beaten who I've had to beat to get to where I'm at. You're getting it Saturday night. We will see, you mate. Getting it. We will see. Muppet. Muppet. I'd like to see you there, found your voice anyway, you don't care. Make sure you bring your nappy and your little dummy and nappy the way and your little tart. Hey, here's a nice fucking girl. Mash it, mash it, listen. Shut up, you little girl. I'll give you a rematch. I said that the first press phone was a little winged baby. Whatever you are. This is going to be a good fight. This is going to be a good fight. But 100% I'm winning this fight. And that's another thing you're doing as well. You're backtracking everything you've said. You got the you got the fight through whinging like a little girl. You give it all all a big I am at the press conference, and then as the fight dawns on us, as the occasions getting closer, you're like a little mouse on Monday. Oh I said to you, look here, you've had your hair cut about time. You've got the fringe out your face, and you muttered, you you don't mash like it, your hair. Mash it, you little you my ass on Monday. You made dead nice on Monday. I just spoke to you, and you backed off like a little pussy. You little gay. I hinted at the end. Why is he being dead nice to me and all that? Me, yeah, you know why you couldn't handle it either, you oh little girl. Oh my god. Well, listen, let's use girls at night, won't we? Okay, bad, bad, bad. okay, okay. See? I want a quick prediction on this one. Tom Stalker, we know you've backed yourself for a win. Do you stop Masha Dodd? If he, if he comes at me the way he thinks he's going to come at me, I will stop Masha Dodd. I'm telling you straight now. Yeah. But he won't. I don't know what he'll do. He's like getting in the stack on the back foot the way he does. He does that fucking job and that. <laughs> Whatever he fucking does. But I'm prepared for whatever he does, I'm winning this fight no matter what, whether it's by point, fucking KO, anything. I'm Stop trying to talk like a scouser, Tom, because the scousers can't oh, even mate. understand you. Talk like where you're from, no, mate. Come on. Masha, do you, do, you, do you stop Tom Stoker on Saturday night? Do you end this inside the distance? No chance. Do you know what? If it was to stop him, I would probably hold him up and, and just keep whacking him. You know what I mean? I just. You know, it's going to be a great fight, and I hope it goes the 12 rounds, and it's going to be a brutal battle, because that's what I prepare for, and that's what I want, yeah? Okay, right, we're going to get moving here, because I know some of you got places to go.